Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Best GIS Tutorial. In today's lecture, I would like to show you how to find out latitudinal and longitudinal value of unknown point data in GIS software. If you are new to my channel, then please subscribe my channel and connect with me for more informative videos. So close this box and remove this data. Now and also add remove this one so first of all go to add data and add any ship file of your study area you can go to catalog and create a ship file in your desired folder click on new and click on ship file the name of point data i just create a ship file with this name and select feature type point and hit at the coordinate system okay okay now the ship file is added to table of content go to symbol selector and change the symbol and increase its size okay now digitize some point data and go to editor tool and start editing and click on point data ok now create feature select point right. now digitize some point I just digitize this point randomly and I will show you how to find out latitudinal and longitudinal value of this point data now go to editor and save the edit and stop the edit now go to table of content and click on attribute table of the point data and here you can see here is no other field such as latitude and longitudinal values now go to table option and add field the name of longitude and here select type float and click on ok and again go to table option and create another field with the name of latitude and here select type float and click on ok now here you can see that I have this field of longitude and latitude but here is no such value of latitude and longitudinal data now here right click on it first go to editor and start the editing click on point data ok now go to longitude and here right click on it and go to calculate geometry and here you can see property select the x coordinate point which show longitude of the data and here you can see the unit and select unit from here I will choose decimal degrees and click on ok now here you can see that the longitudinal data of this point are find now same here click on latitude and go to calculate geometry and here just change the property up to y coordinate of point because latitude represent y coordinate and here select the same unit decimal degree and click on ok now here you can see that I found latitudinal and longitudinal value of this unknown point so I just show you that how to find out latitudinal and longitudinal value of unknown point in GS software if you have already the point data in GS software or you have already point of your study area but you cannot find out the latitude and longitudinal value uh, after seeing this lecture you will be able to find out the latitude and longitudinal value of your point data thank you